Reincarnation, also known as samsara, is a fundamental concept in Hinduism. The idea that the soul or Atman is reborn after death in a new body has been an integral part of Hindu philosophy for centuries. In this article, we will explore the concept of reincarnation in Hinduism, its role in the Hindu creation story, and its significance in Hinduism. We will also discuss the different aspects of reincarnation such as karma, dharma, and moksha. The cycle of birth and death. According to Hinduism, the cycle of birth, death, and rebirth is an eternal process that goes on until the soul attains spiritual liberation. The soul or Atman is said to be eternal and indestructible, and it is only the body that dies. After death, the soul is believed to leave the body and enter into a new body. The type of body that the soul enters into depends on the karma or the actions performed in the previous life. Good actions result in a better birth, whereas bad actions result in a lower birth. This cycle of birth and death continues until the soul attains spiritual liberation or moksha. Karma and Reincarnation Karma is the concept of action and its consequences. It is believed that every action has a consequence, and these consequences determine the type of life that the soul will lead in the next birth. The law of karma is an integral part of the Hindu creation story, and it is believed that the actions performed in previous lives determine the type of life that the soul will lead in the next birth. Karma is also seen as a way to attain spiritual liberation. Good actions, such as performing acts of charity, help to purify the soul and lead to a better birth in the next life. Similarly, bad actions, such as harming others, lead to a lower birth in the next life. Dharma and Reincarnation Dharma is the concept of duty, righteousness, and morality. It is believed that every individual has a specific dharma that they must follow in order to lead a good life. Dharma is also closely related to karma, as following one's dharma is seen as a good action that leads to a better birth in the next life. Following one's dharma is also seen as a way to attain spiritual liberation. It is believed that by following one's dharma, one can purify the soul and attain spiritual liberation. Moksha Moksha is the ultimate goal of Hinduism, and it refers to spiritual liberation from the cycle of birth and death. It is believed that by attaining moksha, the soul is freed from the cycle of birth and death and is reunited with the ultimate reality or Brahman. Moksha is achieved through various means, such as performing good actions, following one's dharma, and practicing yoga and meditation. It is believed that by purifying the soul through these means, one can attain spiritual liberation and escape the cycle of birth and death. Conclusion Reincarnation is a fundamental concept in Hinduism, and it plays a crucial role in the Hindu creation story. The cycle of birth, death, and rebirth is believed to be an eternal process that goes on until the soul attains spiritual liberation. Karma, Dharma, and Moksha are important aspects of reincarnation, and they are seen as ways to attain spiritual liberation. By understanding the concept of reincarnation in Hinduism, we can gain a deeper understanding of Hindu philosophy and spirituality. For more videos stay tuned with us.